Hello everyone. Um, in this webcast, we're going to talk about uh, simple pulley system, how it works, um, what the benefit of using a pulley, and what are the uh, mechanical advantages. So you see here's a very simple pulley. I have a platform here attached to the wire, um, and there is a pulley here, but I'm not using the pulley right now. I'm just using single tied wire and there's another fixed pulley up here so this pulley cannot move it's fixed at the top part so um, when we use a single fixed pulley um, what's the benefit so if we use a single fixed pulley without the pulley I have to pull um, pull the pull the platform upward but if I use the pulley I can pull downward so what it does the fixed pulley is helping me to change the direction um, of the force but when we use one single pulley there is no mechanical advantage what it means is that even if I'm using the pulley at the top here I have to use the same amount of force so the weight if it's a 10 kilogram weight uh, I have to pull uh, with 10 kilogram of weight I'm not getting any mechanical advantage also if you see if I want to move this platform so um, so here if you see the red bar if I uh, want to move uh, the pulley by four or five centimeter I have to pull here you see five centimeter so Similarly, if I want to move the platform one meter, I have to pull one meter. So no mechanical advantage, only the advantage of a fixed pulley is um, that we get a um, we, we, we get the chance to alter the direction of the force. Now to get the mechanical advantage uh, out of a pulley system, now we're going to use um, a suspended pulley instead of a fixed pulley. So what I did, I'm not using this um, wire anymore I, I let it go free I bought another wire here I fixed the top part so I'm not using the pulley I just just fixed I'm using the top part here so I tied up here and then I let go the wire to the only the one pulley uh, that is attached with the uh, platform or the weight so the only change that we have here from the previous one is that instead of a fixed pulley now this is a suspended or moving pulley so when we use a suspended pulley right um, if we apply the load or um, so when I'm pulling you see the total load of, of uh, the platform is uh, supported by these two rope this one and the, this one so the load I have to apply here is the half of the total weight uh, of, of the uh, platform so if it was 10 kilogram now I have to use uh, 5 kilogram of force so I don't have to pull with 10 kilogram of force compared to the previous fixed pulley so I am getting a mechanical advantage it's easier to pull now because I am uh, the the load is split between two two wires, so it's become half. So also, um, so th that's how we're getting the mechanical advantage of a suspended pulley instead of a fixed pulley. The thing is, we are we are still using a pulley, but we're not using a fixed pulley. We're using a moving suspended pulley. One thing is also different from the fixed pulley is that we saw in the first one that if we have to move one meter if we have to leave the platform one meter I have to pull one meter now here if we see if I have to move um, so if I am moving my if I pull like um, one two three four five centimeter on this scale it just move half so if I move six centimeter you will see here the platform is moved only three centimeter why because uh, the distance traveled by the the end of this rope is divided into two sides so that's why 
it is uh, what, what the distance I move the end of the rope here move um, the platform will move only half of the um, of the um, of the movement at this rope end so if I want to move my platform one meter I have to move pull two meter so this is the uh, two is to one ratio um, that we have um, when we use suspended pulley um, so we have the mechanical advantage the force I have to put is half um, compared to the fixed pulley but also the distance um, I have uh, it's half uh, if I move two meter it will move only one meter and the way to look at it is that when I use the suspended pulley it is supported by two wire so the easiest way to think is that um, you can divide the weight that you're pulling by the number of wire suspending uh, uh, the weight so number of section of wire you have supporting the weight so uh, here I have two wire so the weight uh, the tension uh, it will be divided by two if I have three words that I'm going to show you uh, in, in a little bit um, so you'll see uh, that if I have three word the where the weight will be divided by three but for this one this simple one two such two wire two support um, two section so divide the weight by two and you'll get the tension that is half